In this episode, I'm going to show you an updated version of how to install Airtool since the 2.1 update when the launcher was gotten rid of. So it's still really simple. All you have to do is go to flightsim.to and you just do a search for Luke. And the first one there should be Luke Airtool. So you click on that. And then you just have to scroll down and click download. Uh, once this countdown finishes, it's just going to download a zip file. So I will wait for the countdown to finish. All right, so my download has now finished, so I'm going to open up the downloaded file. And you can see inside of here, this is all the files that Airtool needs and uses. So all you have to do is you can make a folder wherever you'd like. I'm just going to put it on my desktop, and I'm just going to call it Luke Airtool. Airtool. And then, once that folder has been created, open up that folder and copy all of the files from the zip into this folder you've just created. We can now close out the zip file and all you have to do now is double click on airtool.exe and if there's a new update to Airtool you'll get this window here and you, then all you have to do to cl is click update and it will do the rest. If Airtool is up to date at this point you won't get this window um, and it'll just take you right to the main menu. However, if you do get the uh, message to update, it'll ask you for administrator permissions and you just have to click yes. And then once that's finished, this window will open up here and then you're all set. 